I come home to this. Hey guys, I'm starting this vlog the night before again, so I have a habit of doing this, um, because I get so caught up hanging out with my family that I don't have time to, like, explain what I'm doing. So, tomorrow the plan is get up, go to church, wrap Christmas presents, and then I think we're going to, like, a Christmas market thing later in the evening, so that's fun um but yeah i'm very excited to wrap presents and yeah that's pretty much all you're gonna see so fun good morning guys it is almost 11 i was gonna get up at 9 30 but i did not sleep well i've also had really bad stomach cramps so not thriving right now um but yeah it's morning also, don't dog me out for wearing this sweatshirt literally every day. It's comfortable, okay? Shut up. Um, but yeah, I'm leaving for church in like 40 minutes. So I should probably get up and get ready and like eat. Um, but yeah. Um, my dad is still really sick, so I don't know if we're going to do the Christmas market thing today. But I definitely do want to wrap gifts today. That is the goal. Um, so yeah, good morning, everyone. Okay, I'm home. I got everything I needed. I got some bows. Just a few because I didn't know how many I'd need. I got this cute little box that I'm going to put one of my sister's gifts in. And then I got this snowman wrapping paper. I use this snow I've used the snowman wrapping paper to wrap my gifts consistently for the past like <laughs> three years. So there was more wrapping paper down there, but I didn't really like the look of it. I think for my mom's, I'm going to use a bag. One of my sisters, I'm going to use this box. And then the other sister, my dad, I'm going to use the snowman paper. And that's it. So let's get wrapping. All right. So these are my sister's gifts. One is cat themed. One is gamer themed. They're really hard to shop for because they're like 12. So like they're kind of outgrowing toys, but they also own every book on the planet. So I got these. I hope they like them. I don't know which one I want to put in the box. I think maybe the cat one. I don't know. She went away on Christmas Day. Didn't come back till New Year. He thought everything had changed. But it was all in his head. A sad invention. As soon as I mention the boy girl do their own thing, no lonely heart. So go on in this wood on the fire. Okay, here's gift number two. I had to wrap it twice because the first time that I wrapped it, it was see through, so you could see what the present was. So it looks a little rough in the back just because I had to wrap it twice. Okay, so for my mom, I got this little box. Inside is a bracelet um, that has a quote about teaching on it. And then I said, check your email for a $25 United Art and Education gift card. Thanks for all you do because I'm going to email her a gift card. And United Art and Education is a store that she really likes where you can get like teacher stuff, like stuff for your classroom and things like that. So, I just got her a cute little bracelet off Amazon for like $12, and then I'm getting her a gift card as well. But I really like the wrapping on this. I love finding little boxes like this because, again, I suck at wrapping, so it's good to have something like this. Now it's time for the big one, which is my dad's. She went away on Christmas Day, he just did gifts are wrapped and under the tree it is 318 and i'm chilling slash editing right now 
Um, so I don't really know what the plan for later tonight is because like I said, my dad is really sick. So we might just be dining in. I don't really know. Um, but yeah, I've just been hanging out. I think I want to do some reading today because I picked back up, uh, The Gleanings by Neil Shusterman, um, at work yesterday and it's getting really good, which I'm kind of shocked by because it's a collection of short stories in set in the universe of the Scythe trilogy, but it's not actually a book in the Scythe trilogy. So I thought I would hate it because there's a lot of authors that do that and I don't like that, um, because it just feels like filler to me. But I'm actually really enjoying it because I really like the world building that Neil Schusterman does. So I feel like these stories contribute to the world building. So I really like it. So I think I'm going to do some more reading of that until it's time for dinner. So I love how I said how I was loving the book. And then I got to a story and I kind of was just like, what is going on? Because like the first few stories were great. But the one that I'm on right now, I'm literally like, what is happening right now? How does this fit into the world at all? It's this dude on Mars, and I'm like, is this one set after the third book? Because that would be the only explanation. I'm just confused. Anyway, that's the update. It's like 5.15 now, so I'm probably going to get dinner at some point. Don't know what dinner is going to be, but... Yeah. Alrighty guys, I am tuning in for the evening and getting ready for bed, so I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. Thank you guys so 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 much for watching. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and the like button and check out my social medias in the description box below and make sure you stay tuned so you don't miss another day of Vlogmas. I love you guys so much. Bye!